like San Francisco rent. A lot of people want to get inside of me, but few can actually afford it. I am an international lady of leisure. Um, but it hurt very oh, much. It hurt very I, heard much. Did, I heard you just did a tour of the Pacific Rim. <laughs> or whatever his name was. Whatever. Yes. <laughs> the first time I took ecstasy, yeah. I uh, had like a, um, what do you call them? A breakthrough. Oh, wow. Yeah, I was 22. So um, I, no I was double dared to take ecstasy by this guy who was hitting on me. He didn't know I was Because that always works. Right? Mm -hmm. Double daring. And I was like, all right, fine. Yeah. Um, and I did it with this guy, and then I'm hanging out with him, and then I'm all like, Ugh, you're boring, your technique is terrible, I'm out of here, this isn't even working, you're ridiculous. I, t I get in the cab, I go back to my apartment. While I'm in the cab, I'm like, oh my God. <laughs> oh my God, what is going on? Oh my God. And then, you know, the cab driver's like, are you okay? Oh, great. I think you should get me home. Woo. Oh. oh you know, so thankfully he gets me home. And uh, then I run into my bedroom. I start stripping wildly, you know, and I'm like, like just like just posing and yeah. boging yeah. in the mirror, yada, yada. Totally. Uh, uh, but then I was staring myself in the mirror and it was like my brain just had this moment and I had a double vision. And I, at that point in my life, I was like 22. I had really terrible, as many people who are trans or in marginalized personalities feel, mm -hmm. I had really negative self-esteem. And um, I felt really bad about myself and very critical. And um, I saw myself, how uh, I was judging myself. And at that same moment, I was like, oh my God, this is how the people who hit on me or the people who enjoy me or think I'm beautiful see me. And it wasn't like that negative part went away, but it was like that, oh, wow, you're actually like, right. you look all right. Like, be kind to yourself. Be, like, this is, this is beautiful, blah, blah, blah. Like, we're not all Vogue magazine covers. We're not all walking around airbrushed every it day. Would be nice, like, but, well, it would be hard. but it's lies. It's yes. lies and technology. Yeah. But, that, but that was a nice moment. It really, and yeah. it really improved my self esteem for the rest That's of my good. life. That's good. I mean, yeah. you know, many people, when they yeah. first take any kind of drug, whether it be LSD or ecstasy, and they get out of their bodies and their minds oh, yeah. in a different way, yeah. well, all of a sudden you perceive things differently and it kind of unlocks some ideas. Is that oh, it totally thing. unlocking is a really good me. unlocking is a really good term. My name is Ben McCoy. That's yeah. what I was given, and uh, thankfully I have a really great I have a really great family, and mm. uh, they are very supportive, and they continue to be so of me, and I'm very lucky for that. Um, mm. However, I found it very shocking that when I moved away to art school in Boston, um, many gay people and queer people uh, would be like. Oh, what's your name? And mm -hmm. you're like Ben, and they'd be like, "Oh no, honey, you're a woman now. What's your girl name?" <laughs> <laughs> and I've and I've had people go even further mm -hmm. and say, and I'll say, you know, my name is Ben, and they'll say, "Oh no, 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 you look you look like a Francesca to me," mm -hmm. and then I say to them, "You are not Master John, and I am not your slave. <laughs> you cannot rename me." No. Um, and then when I call them out on it, they think I'm a bitch. Which <laughs> is true, but I'm not a bitch for that reason. <clears throat> you know? And I've even had people like grab my hair and be like, is all that real? Blah, 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 blah. I've, I mean, I've been published in two books that are anthologies. I went on tour with Sister Spit in 2009. Uh, I'm in the Sister Spit anthology, and I did like a comedic essay about uh, French drag queens. Okay. Do you so, think that God is a woman or a trans or a man? As far as I'm concerned, God Andrew? seems to look a lot like this. <laughs> <laughs> On that note, I'm, I'm lazy with technology, but I love people <laughs> and alcohol. Um, I'm on Facebook, uh, so FB me. Um, I have some terrible stalker boyfriends, so it might be hard. But I'm sure you know someone who knows someone who knows me. So Don't make it all. happen. But if you send a message that flatters me in upwards of 1,200 words, you'll get in. There you go. <laughs> well, it's got to be good because it's got to. It get better be good. Well, oh, those are hard. 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 Hard.